Welcome to this video that's going to teach you more about the Explorer archetype. If you're the kind of person who's committed to your own personal growth and understand that the introspective work you do on yourself can lead to out to success in all areas of your life and business, then you're going to love this series about the 12 archetypes. Hi, my name's Abigail. I'm an over 40 content creator and consultant, and I help other midlife women align their online identity with their inherent personal identity. I do that through content creation consultation based on personality archetypes and follow through all the way to photo and video production. When you have a deeper understanding of yourself, you're able to more easily recognize patterns of behavior, thought, emotion, and beliefs that both hinder and help your personal and professional journey. With this insight, you're able to course correct and realign the traits and characteristics that are authentically part of your inherent makeup. If you've ever felt like a square peg being jammed into a round hole and just not finding the fit, it's likely you're forcing yourself into someone else's idea of a desirable reality. In truth, we all have unique drivers and motivations that we're born with and all too often, due to a lack of awareness and understanding, we find ourselves pursuing an outcome we don't even want, simply because that outcome was presented to us as the only option. When you realize who you really are, it's easier to define what you really want and start taking steps towards a reality that aligns with your true nature. If you don't yet know your dominant archetype, be sure to pause this video and take my free archetype quiz. It'll take you about 10 minutes to complete and then you can hop back on here to finish this video with more clarity. If you've already taken the quiz and you know your archetype, but this isn't the one, head to my channel, check out the playlist on the 12 archetypes and find the video relating to your dominant archetype. So without further ado, let's dig into understanding more about the explorer archetype. The explorer, seeker, wanderer, pioneer. The joy is in the journey, not the destination. The explorer archetype is compelled to find herself. She's compelled to look to the future and thrives when she can experience something new, leaving behind the familiar and commonplace things that she's grown bored with. She sees all of life and business as an exploration and enjoys discovering her own personal growth opportunities, as well as new experiences and adventures. The part of you that's the explorer wants to get out and explore the world in a way that evokes a feeling of absolute freedom to express your true self. Explorers do all they can to break the mold for themselves and others as they embark on their own pioneering adventures. Above all, explorers abhor the thought of leading a life of limitations and boredom. At best, the free-spirited explorer values a life filled with explorations of inner and outer unknowns with a sense of curiosity, adventure, and a willingness to fully experience whatever they discover on their quest. The explorer in you tends to notice the things that are novel and different. She generally suffers with shiny object syndrome because she wants to experience all the things and doesn't want to be limited or restricted. The realms of exploration into which the explorer delves can be physical, emotional, intellectual, or spiritual. But whichever area they're currently exploring, they're always on the go, never static. When an explorer finds herself in the company of others, she reaffirms her differentiating traits so as to avoid the pressures of conformity and potentially losing her individuality. The underlying story plot that exists within the explorer is that of experiencing as much as you can while on an epic mission. Anyone who seems to be trying to control, limit, or prevent the explorer from taking on their next adventure becomes the enemy. The explorer story starts within oppressive routine circumstances that cause the explorer to become bored, feeling stuck, or generally dissatisfied with the way things are. When an explorer breaks free from the mundane, she optimistically goes in search of more interesting and satisfying experiences, which she believes are waiting to be discovered. This may initially result in her wandering aimlessly, but she does eventually find herself developing and growing in search of alternative possibilities. When an explorer encounters a challenge, she tends to get going again to find people, places, ideas, and practices that expand her horizons, becoming the pioneer and trailblazer for others. The part of you that's an explorer finds happiness when she's free to grow and expand. Explorers find meaning, challenging the status quo and showing others where they too can experience freedom and independence. The explorer gains true fulfillment from the experience of the journey, regardless of whether the intended destination is reached. New levels of self-awareness are particularly exciting for an explorer and expressing her true self is of paramount value. Their self-esteem is buoyed even from just being at the forefront of a new trend. 
My hope is that after watching this video, you've got more clarity about the Explorer archetype. Remember, if you don't yet know your archetype, please be sure to go and do my free quiz over at abigailk.com forward slash quiz. This video will resonate a lot more when you know which archetype is your most dominant. If you'd like to learn how you can use personality archetypes to express your personal brand with more clarity and confidence, check out my class on Skillshare. And now over to you. Let me know in the comments three ways in which you're gonna start intentionally expressing your dominant archetype. That could mean changing the way you dress or the jewelry you wear. Or perhaps you're gonna take up a new hobby that you've always wanted to do, but you felt others wouldn't approve. If it aligns with your archetype, start that hobby. Or perhaps you're ready to make the commitment or to change your lifestyle, to bring it more into alignment with who you inherently are. I'm excited to see how this awareness transforms your life.